It's going to be one of the millions of people planning to hit the road this 4th of July. It's suggested you give your car a summer checkup, especially the tires. KLTV 7's J.D. Conti explains. As the Texas heat cranks up, so does the heat on our roads and the strain on our vehicles. If it's 100 degrees outside, it's 400 degrees under that hood. Gary Stewart of Stewart's Donnybrook Automotive in Tyler says if you're going on a road trip this summer, checking your tire pressure is critical. He says to check them after you've driven for a bit. You check your air pressure, it's at 32 degrees, 31 degrees. You go, uh-oh, I need air. Pump the tires up to 35 pounds. You get outside where it's 100 degrees and you're driving on 250 degree asphalt. Now your tire pressure's at 55 pounds because those air molecules expand. And hey, while you're at it, all you need is old Abe Lincoln right here to go ahead and check your tire tread. Take a penny and flip it upside down and place it in the tread. If you can see all of Lincoln's head, it's likely time for new tires. The less tread you have, the less traction with the road. The thinner that tread is, the less likely the water is to shed away from your tire, and the more likely you are to hydroplane. While you might add a lot of miles over the summer, Stewart says it's a good idea to replace tires every three to four years. Mileage aside. If they're three years old, they're harder than they used to be. They'll ride rougher. Uh, you have a greater likelihood of having a blowout. Uh, you're not going to stick on a wet road as good, so three to four years, shelf life max, and get new tires. J.D. Conti, KLTV 7 News. When in doubt, leave it to Lincoln. Stewart also recommends rotating your tires every five to 6,000 miles.